What is up guys, it's Megamark, and welcome to a game called Card Hunter. This is a game that's like Dungeons and Dragons mixed with Magic, The Gathering. Um, I don't know a lot about this game, but I'm gonna get into it. Alright, welcome Megamark. Playing Card Hunter together is gonna be awesome. So this guy, I imagine is like the DM, uh, the Dungeon Master. Let's do Green Fangs Challenge. My older brother Melvin has been telling me how great it is. So yeah, it looks like Dungeons and Dragons, you see all the dice, and like N and N's, instead of M and M's. Your party has survived the undying marshes, following the ancient map to the Goldleaf Blade. Now, approaching the blood-soaked altar of a lizard man shrine, they brace for a final assault. Alright. Cold eyed lizardmen pour forth to defend their temple, commanded by a skeletal apparition. Apparition. Okay. Huh. Play your cards to defeat your enemies. Right click or press spacebar on cards to see what they do. Okay, what is hardy mail? Reinforced here and here. It will last you. A lifetime, well, an average adventure left in life. Armor 2. Key. Oh, okay. Armor 2. When you would take damage, prevent 2 points of that damage. Okay. Keep. Turn this card to your hand or reattach it after it triggers. Okay. So, yeah. I got an elf wizard, a dwarf warrior, and a human priest. Okay. Um. When you're ready, left kick to play it. Um, let's have my warrior go first. Let's have that go up. Whoa! If block is in your hand, you defend automatically if you roll high enough. I got a six. Ah. Okay. When you hover a card, the board shows all squares that can reach. You can reach with that card. Okay. That's how I heal. So priest is a healer. Okay. Let's cast a fireball on him, and a backsplash will hit this guy. Okay. Huh. If you run out of cards, you can pass. After a pass, you can end round to draw new cards. Okay. Let's have my. Oh, I don't get to pick. Huh. Uh, to look at a card I played, open the battle log at the top left and click the card's hyperlink name. What would that be? A battle log. Okay. Uh, plays run. Oh, okay. Um. So I think these red dots represent their health. Maybe. Um, alright. Let's attack that guy. Okay, I think, yeah, I think so. Armor in your hand reduces damage automatically if you roll high enough. Okay, yeah. This is, this is your health. Hover over card number, hover over card numbers and icons to find out what they mean. Okay, that means range. That means move. And that's damage. Okay. So I'm guessing gray. Okay, I'm not gonna make any assumptions because I don't know. Okay, let's try sorcery bolt. Sorceress bolt. Alright. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna pass because I can't attack. Pass again. 
It is my turn to play. When do I get to draw? Um, pass again. <laughs> Gary, end of the round. For Father Ordos to discard. Which one's that? That's the priest, so I get to discard a card. Um, inspiration? Third creature draws card. Oh, well. Alright. Um, he's not gonna be moving. I don't think he's gonna be soon. Starting round. Okay, yeah, that's. Wow, that's a lot better. Um. Alright. So. Can't really. Do anything. Teleport other? Teleport. You may move through any square. Move target character 3. Select a target. Move him. Because he looks like the boss itself. Okay, I teleport him. But Okay. Let's move him right there. So then I can attack him. See, now... There we go. And now... I can kill these guys. Wow. Alright. So, my dwarf is amazing. Victory, onward. Victory! Yeah, victory! The bones of Zor Zuten, Zuten return to dust and the treasure is yours. Yay. Open the chest to claim a treasure. Wow, a legendary drop. Dragon drop the gold leaf blade onto the empty empty weapon slot on the character to the left. Okay. To the weapon. Wow. That's a... 13. And it gets all that stuff, I'm guessing. Alright. Onward, I guess. Whoa! Um... Rumbling shakes the temple. The stones themselves seem to cry out in terror as a caustic reek fills the air. Ambush. Green Fang is here. So if this is anything like Dungeons and Dragons, we're all screwed. Because it's a dragon. Uh oh. Beware, Green Fang's acidic breath and using new cards to avoid his armor cards. Okay. I'm trying to attack from afar. Anyone's gonna take it. Oh, this is gonna be a pushover. Only has 27 hit points. Subtract two when we're going to block this card. Okay. Oh, immunity to electricity. Alright. Reliable mail. Okay. Um, each square can only have one terrain attachment at a time, which I'm guessing that's that. Okay. So if we charge it, uh, if the character's next square, you do one crushing melee damage, and it's unblockable. Okay, well, I'm not going in a straight line. Oh, I can only move two. Okay, let's try to walk instead. So can I cancel it? No? Okay. Um, wow. Ooh, ow, that's a lot of damage. Okay. I don't want to get close to it anymore. Greater heal? Yeah, let's heal. Heal eight. Ow. Okay. Wow, he hurts a lot. So do I. 
Inspiration, I draw a card. Uh, I'm gonna attack skill. Draw a card, discard that card, unless it is a attack card. Repeat until you have drawn two attack cards or have drawn six cards. Wow. Alright, let's use that. Wow. That's awesome. And let's end the round. Start new round. Ow. Boiling armor discards all armor cards. Yeah, let's do that. Bolt. Then, hopefully, I'll be able to kill him this round. Stop. Okay, he can't do that. What's this? Discard terrain attachments for target square. Team shift. Other allies move one. Okay, let's teleport other, select him, go right there, okay, strong back, right there, there we go, all six stars, awesome, victory, victory, with a terrible roar, Green Fang crashes onto the temple floor, uh, the Viridian Dragon's long reign of terror is ended. Woohoo! Woohoo! That was great! Ooh. Gary, what are you doing? You kids can't play Green Fang's Challenge with my party? Wrong. Okay, that makes more sense. We oh, yeah, see, we're level 20. Wow. Alright, that. I was wondering why that was so easy. If you want to play with my Card Hunter set, you have to start at level 1. Oh. Yes, Melvin. Sorry, Melvin. Alright. Onward. Uh, Sorry about that, Megamark. My brother says we have to start again with some new characters. And now... Let's see. Our tale begins in Cardhuntrio, in the musty, dusty Orc's Head Tavern. Hark! An old man staggers through the door, blood streaming from his side. Uh -oh. Help! Monsters are attacking the village! Who will save huh. us? Um... Right click... Or click... Click a tab to choose a Dwarven, Human, or Elven Warrior, and then recruit one. Let's go with a Human Warrior. Uh, name. Um, let's go with... I don't know, Sven. Done. Sven hears the call to adventure, strides over from the bar, and pledges to help the old man. Yay! First adventure, click exit to return to the map. Ah. Uh, with his last breath, the old man gaps and points towards the nearby, uh, nearby village of Omelet. Alright, let's go to Omelet. Yeah! These raiders should be pretty easy for someone who's already defeated Green Fang. Okay, but these characters have it. These are new characters, remember? Huh. I guess starting properly will at least give me a chance to explain a few more rules for you. Okay. Alright, begin battle. Ah. Uh, one guy. Woo! Woo-wee! These cobalt raiders are in a group that shares a single deck. My turn to play. Run, try and attack this guy. Huh. When a group plays a move card, they all move at once. Alright. Bludgeon. Ah. Bludgeon you. Ah. Weak strike. Uh. Huh. Ow. S oh. Simple strike. Ah. Awesome. There's one. Alright, pass. Gary ended the round. Discard card. Starting new round. Huh. 
Um, you always draw one bonus move card. Because you chose human, human, you get the basic run card as your default move. Then you draw two more cards from your deck. Okay. Yeah. Ah! Awesome. Adventure complete. The village is saved from the remaining cobalt and their remaining cobalt raiders scamper off into the fields. The great red villagers. Vi oh my god, I can't talk. The grateful villagers reward you handsomely. The task now remains to track those miscreants back to their lair and put a stop to the attacks. Collect loot. Yay! Uh, Sven found some loot. Open the treasure chest to claim your prizes. Woohoo! Amber shards. They should be worth several gold pieces. Click take all and finish button to move on. Okay, this take oh what does that do? That's just common treasure. Uh head to the armory to exchange your loot for something useful. Yay! So the amber shards you found by dragging them from your collection to the blue sto yeah, blue store sheet. Wow, forty gold. Cards you, uh the cards in your deck come from the items you have equipped. Because you don't have a weapon in this slot, your deck only has these weak cards in it. To fix this, buy a woodsman, woodsman's axe by dragging it from the store onto the empty weapon slot. Okay. Okay, then put it into the weapon slot. Yeah! Wowzers, equipping the axe replaces those weak cards with these powerful new cards. Huh. Mouse over slots or items to see what cards they give you. And you can right click or press spacebar to see the cards close up. Okay. Alright. And then can I sell this? Two gold. Awesome. Exit. Yay! Okay, it's time to get back on the trail of those kobolds. What? Sven searches the fields for tracks and finds a trail leading into the wilderness. And now... Let's get started on the next module, the Cobalt Encampment. Regular adventure. So this is... Yeah, so like I said, this is a lot like D&D &D and uh, magic at the same time. Because it uses cards and uh, it's using some of the aspects, a lot of the aspects from Dungeons & Dragons. Begin battle. Uh -oh. Jeepers, this time you are out number three to one. Not to worry, I have a few hints that'll help you out. Huh. Enemies have to halt when they come when they move next to you, so move uh, to the yellow square to stop them from surrounding you. Okay. Oh. These shield carrying cobalts have block cards. Use your weakest attacks first to draw them out. Okay, so guessing these are like terrain. So they can't go inside of these. So, and, but neither can I. Okay. Um, use weaker attacks. Weak strike. Ha! Those blocks. Yeah! Ow. My turn to play. There. Yeah! Ow. I'm bludgeoning you. Oh. Ah! Your pass and the round. Run, a chop, and a simple strike. Okay, use the weaker attack. Oh wait, they share the stuff. When you have new cards, remember to right click them and see what special abilities they have. Oh, I get two targets for this attack. Awesome. Give it your pass, and end round. And let's end this guy. Here we go, adventure complete, onward. Um, having dispatched the raiding party, you overturn their camp and liberate what items they have. Searching the area reveals a cave mouth and a crude earthen tunnel leading into the darkness under the hills. Is this where the cobalts have come from? Only further adventures will tell. Collect the loot. Level up! Level 2, awesome. I can get a shield. I have more health and a shield. Chest. Barrel. Whoa. 
Whoa, a rare item. The Cobalt Killer. This should come in handy. Take all. S okay. Um, that's just treasure. Cobalt Killer. It's a rare weapon. Okay, and that's a common weapon. So can I equip more than one? Yeah, alright. Awesome. There we go. Alright, awesome. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to leave the video here. So, this is really fun. This is coming from a Dungeon Dragons player. So, um, I really enjoy this game. Um, I hope you guys did too. And I will see you all next time.